Hey guys, how's it going? Daniel here. And it's that time again where I get to share with you guys the top 10 apps for this month. So let's begin. So the first one will have to be Action Launcher. So Action Launcher uh, this month uh, got a huge update. It got uh, renamed, so now it's only called Action Launcher. And it just uh, ha has had um, a big release with new features and new updates uh, to help you and to make it look really nice on your Android smartphone and to make it ready for Android Whoa, uh later this year as well. All right, so Curvy is a great icon pack. It takes the inspiration from the adaptive uh, icon uh, feature that will be coming to Android O. Um, so it's a different shapes with circular and rounded uh, square edges. And it's just a really, really great icon pack with some nice designs and a lot of to choose from if you want to customize each icon pack manually if you don't like the default versions of the icons. This week it will have to be for third uh, app of this week, uh, of this month I mean, it will have to be Twitter. Uh, Twitter this week has, uh, well not this week, but this month has released an, a huge update to its uh, Android app with a new re redesign of its app and it looks really, really nice. Um, and also some other nice features that Twitter has added just to make uh, using Twitter on the Android app really, really easy. Um, and really, really useful as well. All right, so next we have Wall On. So Wall On is a f fantastic wallpaper app. Um, really a lot to choose from, a lot to uh, uh, to choose from and cut, uh, to make uh, your Android smartphone your own. And it's just some really, really neat uh, pictures there to have uh, on the background of your Android smartphone. Fifth we have here is called Phoenix. So this is the new version of Phoenix that will be coming out uh, later this year. Um, right now it's in beta, so you can go and download it right now for free. Uh, but the uh, full version, the final version will be paid. But right now Phoenix, this one, it's one of my favorite Twitter clients right now on Android. Um, I've been a fan of the first one and I'm happy that the developer is making a new one as well. Um, and it's just a really, really fantastic Twitter client if you're not a fan of the main Twitter app or you're not a fan of the other Twitter clients on Android. Next, we have Top 10 List. Top 10 List is a, a great app to learn uh, new things about uh, what's around you in the world and for some fantastic uh, points. Uh, that you can read in articles and you get to learn uh, new things that you probably have never le uh, learned or have never heard about. Um, so top 10 list is a great app to, to learn uh, new facts uh, about other stuff that uh, you might have not known. Next we have Hook Zooper. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Hook Zooper is a great uh, Zooper uh, app package, I guess you could call it, widget pack uh, that allows you to customize your Android smartphones, home screen, or any other screen um, with some great uh, third party Zooper packs. Um, and it's just really, really fantastic. And it's really uh, nicely designed, and there's a ton of widgets, Zoopers you can use and, uh, to make your smartphone your own design. Next, we have PixUp. So if you're a fan of the Google, uh, of, of a lot of stuff that Google is all about, the design, all that, PixUp is perfect for you. It's another Zooper widget pack um, that is only about Google uh, uh, widgets that you can add onto your home screen. So there are a ton to choose from, um, and it's just really, really neat uh, uh, PixUp. Next, we have Passport 2017. So if you're a Canadian, you know that this year it's Canada's 150th birthday. And with Passport 2007, you'll be able to uh, learn new facts about Canada uh, that you might have not known about. Uh, and because it's this year's uh, is Canada's 150th birthday, you can now um, 
with this app with Passport 2017, you'll be able to find out facts or even find out uh, events that are happening around your area. And you could go and celebrate uh, and look at some cool stuff uh, with Passport 2017. And not least but not last, we have here an app called Battery Widget. So Battery Widget, it allows you to diagnose and just see really deep dive into your batteries uh, about the battery information on your Android smartphone. What I like about this app is that it has a kind of, of a notification widget app. Uh, so when you scroll down the uh, notification area, you'll be able to see a lot of information about the battery app and uh, and be able to control some stuff from there as well um, without having to open settings and all that stuff on your Android smartphone. So that's it. Those are the top 10 apps for this week. Uh, I mean, for this month. Sorry. Um, and I will see you guys later. Peace.